Folks, we're this close, we're so close to the coming of the Lord. Listen to me, please. What I tell you now is prophetic, and I believe with all my heart. I believe that God is going to open the new covenant. This is going to be the one message of the last days that sets men free from the power of sin. Because the power of sin is going to get so incredibly powerful. There's going to be wickedness beyond anything we know even today. And God has to bring forth truth. Only truth can stand against this onslaught of the devil. Folks, if I stand and just berate sin, if I try to just get you down here to cry and weep for two hours because I have beaten you down with the message of conviction, you can get up and walk out and last for three weeks. But if you get this truth in your heart that God has made me a promise, not mine to him but his to me, God has made me a promise. And I'm going to stand before the devil and all, the, all of the demons of hell and say, I stand here now. Though my house be not what it should be, God has made me an everlasting covenant. That's sure. This is the one thing the devil doesn't want you to know. You're going to hear more and more of it. Not just from this pulpit. But I believe God's going to speak to godly men all over this earth in this last day, and He's going to bring forth the Word. Hallelujah. God has remembered His covenant. He's never forgotten it. He's going to move now. Hallelujah. Are you beginning to understand now how much God loves you? Do you understand now that all that God wants out of you and me is, is to loathe our sin, to have a hunger and thirst for righteousness, and to say, I want to walk pleasing before God. And in that struggle, he'll come down with his truth and his power. And thank God for the Holy Ghost. Thank God for the Holy Ghost. That's why I don't understand who people, people just want the Holy Ghost to tickle them. They just want the Holy Ghost to knock them down. I don't want the Holy Ghost to just knock me down and tickle me. I want the Holy Ghost to deliver and distribute to me all the power of Jesus Christ in my life. Hallelujah.